are cookies. What? Your cookies didn't look sweet enough. You're welcome, Bernard. He sabotaged our cookies. They look pretty good now. Skittles. All right. Well, that's fine with me. Happy birthday to you. Oh <laughs> Where's the rest of my song? <laughs> I'm not singing the whole thing. <laughs> to you, happy birthday, dear Shelby. <laughs> happy birthday to you. And many more. Make a wish. Yay. Yay Gainer's you. terrified of the balloon no when I walked wonder. in. I have to relight the candles because Brady was asleep and I want him to experience his very first birthday candles. <gasps> Brady, you want to see some, you want to see a match? You want to see fire? Look, Brady. I don't know why I'm pointing. Look. Look at the candles. Look. Oh, <laughs> almost burnt. That looks scared of the balloon. <laughs> Brady, look at the candles. Don't sneeze on my cake. <laughs> He's like, oh, I see it now. You see those? <laughs> what is going on, everyone? Today is Shelby's birthday. <laughs> she is 36 years old today. <laughs> I'm just kidding. She's not that old. She is 26 today. Uh, so we're going to celebrate uh, by going shopping today and then going out to eat later on. Mr. Brady's here with us. He is all decked out in his Christmas colors. Check this out. Say hey, say hey vlog, say hey. He's all decked out in red. He's got some red socks. He's got a Christmas tree bib on. Hey buddy. And he is just all excited about going shopping. Uh, so how old are you today, Shelby? 36? Shut up. <laughs> so the butt of the outfit. Uh, no, I did not show y'all Brady's butt. It's the best part. Oh yeah, that is the best part by far. <laughs> I've been getting so many comments about my hair recently. Everyone's hating on my hair. Aww. I know, it's sad. Why? I, I guess it's too long and the way I'm styling it's different, but people are not liking it. So, I don't know, are y'all gonna like tear me up about my hair this time? <laughs> I, I don't know. Uh, it's gotten way too long. Yes, it did get too long, but I did get it cut. And I think he actually cut it too short on the bangs. Everything else is like fine but the bangs is actually shorter than what I was wanting it done. But oh well. I got Shelby Gangnam Style uh, flowers and then got her cake. Uh, what else did I get you? I don't what? even know. Oh, and the balloon. And Gaynor's terrified of that thing. Uh, and then later on, I'm gonna have to give her a gift. I haven't even wrapped it yet. Shocking. <laughs> Shocking, yes. So I do have to wrap her a gift before giving it to her. And then I got her a card. Oh, that is the worst part about any kind of birthdays or Valentine's is picking out cards. I absolutely hate it because I hate having to sit down and write it. I, I posted a photo uh, for Shelby on uh, Instagram and I said that should be her card. Just me sitting there writing out a text, but that won't work, will it? That won't. You, no. You don't say Dang it. it. Now we're getting the car washed. Mr. Brady just sitting out here waiting for the car. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm also growing out my beard here. Yeah, this is about the only beard that I can grow. <laughs> I'm trying to grow this to connect my mustache and my goatee. Shelby's like, stop, you need to stop. Uh, I don't think it looks terrible. I'm gonna try to grow it out as long as possible. Even if it's like five hairs that is down to here. I'm gonna grow it out, right? Is that okay? Yeah, go ahead, do that. <laughs> it looks really good. I'm gonna be Santa Claus before Christmas. <laughs> Oh, it looks so much better now that it's washed. So now, getting some Starbucks before we start shopping. So we're basic, we went with a skinny mocha, we got a venti, we got half decaf and half normal because we need a little pick-me-up before we go get the Christmas spirit on and go shopping. Mom said right? I need to be careful about going Christmas shopping or I'm gonna get in a different kind of spirit. With all these crazies. <laughs> yeah, crazies are everywhere. The roads are packed. Everything is just ridiculously packed. Uh, Austin already has bad traffic, but today I was driving around and it's like double the traffic. I guess everyone's uh, getting last minute gifts and stuff. I don't know, but it's ridiculous. Oh, that's delicious. Oh yeah. 
The only issue I have with skinny mochas and stuff is they're just not hot enough. They can't make them hot enough. I ordered uh, extra black hot. coffee. Yeah, she ordered extra hot and it's still not hot enough for me. I have to have it like burning. So our very first stop is gonna be Marshall's. We need to take stuff back and then look for maybe what three different gifts for people? My youngest brother, my dad, and my mom. Two of the hardest people to shop for. <laughs> and all that line. Now we're testing out Brady to see what he wants for Christmas. I think he wants Brady. Mickey Mouse. Do you want this? Do you want this? Do you want that? Maybe? How about no, Mickey Mouse? No, he wants Mickey Mouse. You want Mickey Mouse? What toy? We should not be showing him what he's getting for Christmas. I think he wants Mickey Mouse. You want Mickey Mouse? Oh yeah, I think he does. <laughs> okay, Mickey Mouse is a win maybe. So we're done at Marshall's. We got Gaynor a present. We found my brothers and uh, we found some other gifts that, of course, we didn't need or we thought we were gonna buy because we already bought gifts for these people, but we still had uh, to buy more. <laughs> and that's what happens when you go to Marshalls and Target and all those places. You end up buying stuff that you initially didn't go in there to buy. So now we're gonna run in one other place, get my dad's gift, and we still need to find something for my mother. So we're done shopping pretty much, and now we're gonna get dinner. We are at the same place that uh, we went for my birthday. It's called Jack Allen's. It is a delicious place here in Austin. I've only been, I guess, what, twice? This would be my third time because I had breakfast that yeah. time. It was mm -hmm. delicious. This will be my and fourth time. this would be your fourth, fourth time. Yeah. So we're gonna run in here and grab some good burgers or something. I don't know what you're gonna get. I like burgers. I know, I'm gonna get a burger. <laughs> Is he nice? He's not that happy. <laughs> no, he's not. Oh my gosh, this food looks amazing. Look how big that burger is. So I got a fat jack is what it's called. Shelby got a fat jack as well, but she got the single patty. I got a, I got a double. And then we have nachos right there. Brady's just eyeballing it. Are you jealous? Shelby's little dessert for her birthday. No, I'm not saying. <laughs> We're done eating. That was delicious. How was yours? Good. Yeah, the burger was amazing. And her dessert was really delicious. good as well. It was like chocolate mint. Very, very good. And we also have that cake that I bought her at the house too. <laughs> We're probably not gonna eat tonight, or we might, because we're gonna be wrapping presents and stuff, so we're gonna be up for a while. Ugh, not looking forward to that at all. So now we're back home, and my mission is to pick Shelby's gifts. So, you know, her birthday so close to Christmas that I just buy a lot of gifts, and then I have to decide what ones I wanna give her on Christmas and what ones I wanna give her on her birthday. So my stash this year is right behind here, so Shelby's not allowed behind these suitcases. Oh, so this is all her presents, all these bags, boxes, oh, and then this Santa bag of gifts. This has like maybe three different gifts, like smaller gifts in it. So now I need to just decide what ones I want to give her uh, today. A few moments later. I gave Shelby her presents. I love Show them. Show them what ones I decided to give you. <laughs> <laughs> so I gave her a little Pandora bead. It is a uh, Rudolph or a reindeer. Do they know about my Pandora? Mm, I've uh, had bracelet. since forever. No, she's had it since my high school graduation. Her, yeah, when high school it. graduation. Oh my gosh. I'm not it's that still, old. Oh my gosh. It's still like a thing now. It's Golly. Thing. So I've yeah. been getting her be like beads every so often. He got it for my high school graduation so that he could have an easy gift. To oh man, it's been amazing. <laughs> it's been amazing. And then I got her a custom necklace that it's has... A bar that's necklace. Not focusing. It's a bar necklace that has Shelby's... Oh, that's the date that we were married. And then has my name on it and then Shelby's name. Yeah. And I love it so much. Yep. She's loves anything to do with love. <laughs> Makes me sick. Now we're tearing into her birthday cake. It is so good, that chocolate cake. Oh, yum. And then I got some frozen yogurt to go with that. Uh, butter pecan, yeah. And then we have Shark Tank going on. We're gonna pick a Christmas movie, and then we're gonna start wrapping everyone's gifts. It's not gonna be a very fun night. Shelby, I think, likes wrapping presents. I yeah, I do not. So I do not like it. What are you doing? So now Shelby's trying to teach me how to wrap presents properly. Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. It takes you three times longer to wrap presents her way. 
She says it makes you want to open them more if they're beautiful. Is that true? Because they I think nicer. wrapping is just to cover up the present. I don't think it makes you want to open it more. But look at the tree. It look, looks so look, much look better. Look at the tree. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. I'm wrapping mine in, of course, the elf wrapping paper. <laughs> yes. You're ruining my tree. You disgust me. Oh my gosh, we are done wrapping. Uh, we did not wrap everything. As you can see, I have the elf wrapping paper here. These are Shelby's presents. <laughs> Ha ha ha, I had to. It gives us so much color. Look, it looks so much better now that you have the elf and then her wrapping paper. It just gives it a little pop. So, I'm gonna go to bed because it is 11, uh, 45 and we have a big day tomorrow getting ready for two week trip to Memphis visiting family uh, over you know Christmas and New Year's. So we have a lot to do tomorrow. So I'm gonna pick this vlog up tomorrow and then also that's gonna be when I work out stuff. I'll video tomorrow's workout. All right guys, I'll see you in the morning. Well, good morning everyone. Well, actually it's not morning at all. It is uh, 3.45 and I just now started vlogging, but check out what Bernard has done today, what he got into. He is downing some Vapor One and getting some kind of workout in. I think he's resting. I think he was doing bicep curls. That's what he was doing earlier today. Uh, how's your pump, dude? So, yeah, so late actually starting vlogging. I've been editing all day long, and then uh, I was gonna go to New Fit and record a workout at New Fit, but uh, I dropped the ball. I was headed out the door around 11:10 uh, this morning to get there at 11:30, and then I thought, oh, I'm just gonna check my email to see what time they told me to come in, just to make sure it was 11:30, and it was 11 o'clock. So I missed my appointment at New Fit. So I called uh, Malik up, and I was like, Hey, man, I am so sorry, I missed the 11 o'clock appointment. Uh, is there any way I can come in like 11:30? And he was like, Oh, man, I got one at 12 o'clock. So ended up not going to New Fit. Turned back around, came back here, and then finished up a video on editing so I don't have to do that like tomorrow or later on today. So now I'm going to go to the gym and work shoulders, but I already posted a shoulder workout. This video that I'm just uploading right now is a shoulder workout, so I can't do two shoulder workouts back to back. So I have a back workout that I never posted maybe months back because it was back uh, in Memphis, Tennessee when I recorded it. So I'm going to let you watch that back workout instead. So I will see you after that workout in a bit. What's going on everyone? It feels great being back here editing videos and producing more videos. Now I know I've not posted a new video in a long time. That is because I spent the holidays with family back in Memphis and I really didn't want to take that time editing uh, and producing more stuff because I was, you know, busy uh, visiting with them because I don't really get to see them that much. Uh, so anyways, I hope you all had a great holiday. I know I did. So let's go ahead and jump straight into this high volume back workout. So we started off with wide grip lat pull downs. I did five sets of around 15 to 20 reps and on the last set did a triple drop set. So this workout is a little bit different because uh, what I'm trying to focus on is getting 15 to 20 reps on uh, this whole entire workout. So it's different than what my typical workouts are because a lot of the times I'm going down to like six to even eight reps in a workout. But this workout I tried to stick around 12 to uh, 20 reps now are 12 15 to 20 reps and uh, now I did not go down in weight I actually uh, still lifted extremely heavy because as you're seeing right now I'm lifting the 120 pound dumbbells for 20 reps uh, now the reason why I'm able to get out 15 to 20 reps with heavy weight is because I'm going a little bit quicker so the reps are a little bit quicker than what I typically do so as you can see I'm repping it out and not necessarily uh, you know going slow with the reps uh, because in a normal workout uh, the 120 pound dumbbells I will do maybe 15 reps and be completely shot uh, but because I'm uh, going quicker through the reps I'm able to get out 20 reps with those 120 pound dumbbells so I did five sets of uh, 20 reps with the dumbbell bent over rows and on the last set did a triple drop set and this is what you're watching right so, so uh, what you're watching right now so what I'm doing is going to failure uh, with the 120 pound dumbbells drop it to the 90 pound dumbbells go to failure again on that same arm drop it again to the 70 pound dumbbells and then do one more drop that I did not record it was the 50 pound dumbbells and just going to failure on every single one of these uh, drop sets so uh, 
what I'm doing differently in this workout, uh, like I said, is lifting more reps, and that is because my body's not used to this. This workout was extremely hard because, uh, you know, I'm not used to this. My body was gasping for air the whole time. I was extremely exhausted. There was so much blood into the muscle, which felt, you know, really good, but at the same time, it was very tough because. Uh, what you try to do when you work out is do things that your body's not used to so that it tears down muscle and so that way your body will grow. If you uh, go all the time doing the exact same workouts over and over again, your body will not grow because it doesn't need to adapt. So you need to do things that your body's not used to. So after those dumbbell bent over rows went into barbell bent over rows, I did five sets of 15 and 20 reps, and on that last set, which you're watching right now, I did a drop set, just a single drop set. So I went to failure for those 15, 20 reps with the 225 pound, um, you know, bar, and then immediately dropped the weight by 90 pounds, just 45s on each side, and then went to failure again. I think it was around maybe 10 to 12 reps. Uh, after that, went into seated cable rows. Five sets of 15 to 20 reps, and then on the last set, and this is the last set, I did a double drop set. Uh, so as you can see what I'm doing with this seated cable row, I'm trying to go all the way forward, stretch, and then pull back, squeeze the whole entire time throughout this whole uh, movement. Uh, like I said, throughout this workout, you have so much blood in your muscles because those high reps. Uh, you know, when you're lifting for, uh, you know, heavy for eight reps to six reps and stuff, you don't get as much blood in that muscle as you do with uh, 15 to 20 reps because it's a lot of time under tension too because uh, if you're lifting like eight reps, you know, time under tension might be, I would say, 25 seconds you know, if that, but when you're lifting 15 to 20, 20 reps, you're going to be right at like 30 to 45 seconds in between sets. So it's a lot of time under tension. Uh, after those seated cable rows went into bent over T-bar rows, and this is the exact same thing. We did uh, five sets of around uh, 15 to 20 reps. I was trying to go extremely heavy on this, and sometimes I would actually uh, get only like 12 reps instead of those 15 so I would have actually have to drop the weight so that I'm able to get those 15 reps this is the last set this is the fifth set and this is a drop set that I have no no idea how many uh, drop sets I did so what I would do is go to failure and then my brother Gabe would actually strip off a 45 pound plate so it ended up being I think a triple drop set and so he would just drop off a 45 and I go to failure um, then he would drop another 45, I'd go to failure. So the main thing is that I was just going to failure on every single one of those drop sets. And this is the last movement right here. It's a close grip uh, lat pull down. And I did five sets of those 15 to 20 reps. And this is the last set. Uh, and it's a, it's a double drop set. I think I only recorded a single drop set here. But that is the end of the workout, guys. I hope you enjoy it. Now, I'm going to be getting up a whole lot more videos here in this new year, so be patient with me. I have a lot, uh, lot of new stuff coming, so I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you on the next one. I'm back home from the gym. It has been total chaos the last couple of hours. So getting back and then started packing and we have to load up everything. And then we have a Christmas party to go to with friends. Uh, so we don't have much time to actually get all this stuff done because we leave tomorrow early uh, tomorrow morning. Uh, I'm telling you, we got stuff everywhere. All my supplements in that bag. We got all Brady stuff. And then we have, of course, my Nerf guns that I gotta bring. And let me show you the closet right now. It is just chaos. Uh, we've been working like crazy and Brady is not helping a thing. He's been crying constantly. So there's my bag. Uh, we just have so much to do uh, because that party starts at eight o'clock and then we have to get back and load all the stuff in the car before tomorrow morning because we wanna have all that done so we can just get up in the morning and then just jump in the car and then leave. But we'll see if that's gonna be possible because <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm exhausted, my back hurts. It's just been chaotic. So I'm gonna end the video here because it's not gonna be fun uh, watching us pack and stuff. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe and I'll see you all next time. All right guys, peace. Brady's first time seeing candles.
or a birthday cake for that matter. Shelby's birthday cake. <laughs> Brady, look. Brady, look. I think he likes the balloon better than anything, though. Or he doesn't really care either way.